Do you know what a spreadsheet software is? It is an application program that allows text, numbers and formulas to be entered in grid cells. Microsoft Excel is the most popular electronic spreadsheet software. Let's discuss about MS Excel 2010 now. This is the opening page of MS Excel 2010. The topmost bar is called the title bar. It reflects the name of the file. The ribbon consists of tabs that contain editing and formatting features in groups. The formula bar displays the active cell address on its left and the cell contents on its right. The cell contents can be edited from the formula bar. This is the frame. It consists of a horizontal bar of letters showing the column letters and a vertical bar showing the row numbers. The scroll bars are used to view different areas of the worksheet by scrolling up, down, left or right. The sheet tabs allow us to move quickly to another worksheet by clicking on the corresponding tab. Enter the first and second values in the first two adjacent cells. Select both the cells. Place the pointer in the lower right corner of the selected range. Drag the mouse while pressing the left button to cover the required cells you want to be filled. Changing the appearance such as font style, size and alignment is called formatting of data. To format the font, follow these steps. Select the cell or cell range. Select the font style, color and font size by clicking on the drop-down arrows of the corresponding boxes in the font group on the Home tab. To make the text appear in bold, italics or underlined, click the respective icon in the font group. To save a worksheet, follow these steps. First, select the Save As option from the File tab. The Save As dialog box opens. From the Save As dialog box, select the folder where you want to save the file. Enter a suitable name for the file in the file name box. Click the save button to save the file. To print a worksheet, follow these steps. Click file. Choose the print option. The worksheet will be printed after you fill the boxes on the next page and then click the print option. To close the active worksheet, Click on the Close option in File. To quit Excel, click on the Exit option in the File tab. Wasn't it fun learning about MS Excel?